Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David, and this is a Magic Wallet review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. That's right, we're doing another Magic Wallet. Done a lot of wads recently, right? Been doing a fun amount of wallets. This is another wallet though from Big Blind Media. You might remember we did the review for the wrist cuff wallet and they actually sent me another one, like a, like a Packetrick holder, uh, like an accordion wallet. We'll look at that uh, coming up. But this is the Pimpernel wallet from Peter Scarlet. Peter Scarlet came out with this in like 1994, I think. And Big Blind Media, they have the rights to it now. Listen to this, you're gonna get a real leather wallet that has Himber capability, card to wallet capability, peak capability in real leather. You're gonna get an eight minute tutorial, a 24 page PDF for $65. What? Yep, 65 bucks. Do you wanna watch my talking head or do you wanna see the wallet? Let's look at the wallet. First up, you're gonna get this card, okay? And the card actually opens up. I can't show you the inside because the tutorial uh, download code is on the inside, but on the inside it has some graphics about the wallet's orientation and some of its features. And of course, like I said, you'll get the download code that's eight and a half minutes uh, in the Big Blind Media Studio. And then the 24 page PDF will show up in your downloads section uh, when you purchase from Big Blind Media. And this is the Pimpernel wallet. So you can see that it is a billfold gentleman's wallet right? And opening it up, you'll have an ID window here and a zippered compartment here. The trick is that you have two uh, functions for a Himber. So you have a Himber feature here in, we'll call this side A, but then you have a identical Himber version here, which is side B. And this Himber feature really is the card to wallet slash peak. So both, um, both function the same way. But you also get a Himber here. So you have a Himber in the billfold in this lining and that lining. So two, two ways to do a Himber wallet, a couple different fun ways to do a card to wallet, including a no palm card to wallet, right? That's how they do it. They do it as a no card because there's no, there's no slide, there's no glide on this. It's a no, no palm card to wallet and the peak. And that happens within the, the zippered feature that's here. You'll pull their card, the card to wallet, you'll pull their card out of the zippered compartment. But yeah, real leather wallet, isn't that amazing? Real leather wallet with all those features for 65 bucks. So is it what I thought? Um, kind of, it was kind of what I thought. When I saw it, it looked a lot like the Infinity Wallet, right? And the Infinity Wallet was a big favorite for a lot of people and sold out a long time ago. And, or at least I know Black sold out a long time ago. Infinity is a little different in that it has a pocket, it has a snap pocket on one side and not a zipper, but it doesn't have that pocket twice. It only has it once. This, with the zipper feature, what that allows you to do is have a mirrored zipper feature on the second half on side B, right? So the Infinity, didn't look the same. They used it as a Himber when you opened it, but it didn't look the same because the snapper, the snap, snapped pocket was on that one side. So I think this does the Himber feature with the, with the opening and closing a lot better than the Infinity. But the Infinity also had the, um, the Himber feature in the billfold as well. Plus it did peak, plus it did card to wallet, some of the same features. Um, Infinity came with a much larger tutorial, but I don't, you don't need that. You don't need that big tutorial. So there's no, there's no like fully fleshed out tricks in this. Like I said, the download's only eight and a half minutes. So it's just Biz in the Big Line Media Studio and he's walking you through just the um, no palm card to wallet aspect. That's it, okay? He's gonna show you how to do the no palm card to wallet. He's gonna give you two different options. If you wanna learn all the other features, I mean, the, the billfold, I'm sure you can figure out. But if you wanna learn how to do the peak and some of the other routines, then you'll go to the 24 page PDF. And in that, they teach you a card to wallet routine. They teach you a totally impossible stop trick, 
uh, an ACAN of sorts that you do with a mini card, several more routines, and the instructions about how to get your peak. So you definitely want to go back to the PDF and glean it for all of its goodness. But you saw the wallet. I mean, if you, if you already can do some of those things, you're already familiar with magic wallets, you're probably going to fall into this perfectly. And for those of us that love the gentleman style wallet, this is another great option. There's not a lot of pockets and windows for making this your everyday carry. A lot of those um, zippered compartments and things, those are needed for card to wallet, needed for peak, right? So you don't want to fill it up with a bunch of credit cards and ID. It's probably not going to work it work that well. You could stick some um, everyday carry style cards or maybe a fake credit card that does a magic trick, right, in there. But I'd probably leave it at that and maybe some gaff bills if you wanted to do it that way. I'd probably carry it though as, as a, as a, as a magic wallet, not, a, not your personal wallet. You might be able to play around with it if you kept it minimal, right? There's kind of, because there's just not a lot of pockets. I'm weird, I fill all my pockets in my wallets. I stuff my wallets full of stuff. So, but this is a really nice gentleman's wallet. And the fact that it's real leather for 65 bucks, I mean, a wallet like this usually sells for more than 100, easy. So 65 for uh, Big Blind Media's wallet, or at least that's what it was when I went on their website today. So maybe uh, you might want to check around uh, and see what the price has gone up to. But it was $65 the day I looked at it. So yeah. But I think as far as angles and inspectability goes, you know, the fact that it has that Himber feature and the fact that it looks the same when you flap it, I wouldn't hand it out, right? This isn't... And I, let's not discredit tricks when we say, oh, it can't be inspected, or those cards can't be inspected, or that deck can't be inspected. If your spectators are constantly asking you to inspect your props, then you're doing something wrong, okay? You should be instilling confidence in your spectators when they watch you. Uh, you're a con man, yes, or a con woman, right? You're a con artist, but... You, they shouldn't know that. <laughs> You're a liar, but they shouldn't know that. They should trust you. Uh, so yeah, and, and and wallets. We don't you don't hand your wallet out to somebody. Okay, you don't say here inspect my wallet. Nobody does that, right? So you shouldn't you shouldn't have anything to worry about there. Set up and reset. It kind of resets itself. It does. I mean, if you do the card to wallet, chances are it was signed, right? You're gonna give them that card, and then you'll take whatever prop you had in there before and put it back and you're, you'll, you'll be reset. So positives, there's a whole bunch of great features to this, a whole bunch of great features. So, and to have those features all available to you in one wallet for under a hundred bucks in real leather, I think is great. Negatives, um, you know, Big Blind Media tried to update the, the video so that you wouldn't need the PDF, but I think just the fact that they don't cover, uh, they don't cover the billfold um, Himber, and they don't cover the peak in the video. So at under 10 minutes, you know, m maybe the video is a little lacking, but that's it. Like, I, and I think if you collect wallets and you're looking for a magic wallet, chances are you've got some tutorials lying around that this could easily be adapted to, right? I mean, we know, we know, we know some tricks. We know some tricks for sure. But I want to let you know about the Pimpernel wallet from Big Blind Media. Really cool purchase. Thanks for watching, guys. And thanks to Big Blind Media. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Hey, would you like to learn a magic trick? You would. Did you know I have a second channel? That's right. I have a second channel where I teach beginning level magic tricks. Magic Channel Card Tricks is a place that you can go to to learn tricks with ordinary items you can find around the house. Paper clips, rubber bands, pens, and of course, decks of cards. I teach beginning level card tricks. Simple card tricks, simple card forces that anybody could learn. I also review magic kits. So if you go buy a magic kit from the store, uh, your local Walmart or Target, uh, or you get a magic kit for Christmas, I'll go over exactly what's inside. And I'll even teach you how to perform with some of those tricks that you get inside those kits. Plus, I'm even going to give you video instruction to very simple, very inexpensive tricks that you can pick up at your favorite magic store. Sometimes you get those tricks and the instructions are just on a tiny little piece of typewritten paper and you have no idea how to do that trick. Don't throw that trick away. Don't put it in a box. Come back to Magic Channel Card Tricks and I will teach you how to use that trick as well. Or maybe you're not a beginner. Maybe you're not a beginner, but 
maybe you have a niece or a nephew or a little brother or sister that is, that you could share this channel with them. This is a great, safe place, kid-friendly, where they can learn beginning level magic. Make sure you head on over to Magic Channel Card Tricks. Give my videos a like. Subscribe to that channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for being a part of Magic Orthodoxy.